it looks like the 49ers just got played because the Detroit Lions just matched the 49ers three-year, $12 million offer sheet for restricted free agent tight end Brock Wright. That means the 49ers spent time negotiating a contract with Wright, working out all the little details, probably lots of hours and effort went into making this a cohesive contract offer. And Wright signed it. And the Lions had a week to match it. They did freaking nothing. They sat on their hands all offseason, didn't engage with Brock Wright, looked at the contract the 49ers negotiated with them, thought about it for a week, let the Niners think that they were going to sign Brock Wright, let the Niners think that they had filled their hole at tight end and were out of the market at that position, and then at the very last minute, match the offer. It's like, hey, 49ers, thank you very much for doing all the work for us, and by the way, you still need a tight end because we're going to keep Brock Wright, so thank you. It's very generous of you. We didn't actually want to work, or we were playing dominoes. And we have a very competitive game of dominoes going on. And we didn't want to think about Brock Wright because he's just our backup tight end. And frankly, doesn't matter to us. We know you wanted him because Charlie Warner wanted to live in Georgia over playing for you. So you needed our tight end. We let you think that you were going to have him for about five days while we played dominoes and drank cocoa. It's really delicious cocoa. And then we decided, no, nah, we'll keep Brock Wright. So you're going to go have to find your own tight end and leave ours the hell alone. Thank you. It's a bad look when a team tries to sign a restricted free agent away from another team and fails. So you spent all that time and effort drafting the contract and negotiating and doing the work just for the other team to be like, yeah, we'll take him. Thanks. Like the Niners really thought they were going to have Brock Wright. This feels a little like amateur hour. And I'm not saying the Niners are amateur hour as a team because they've been to a lot of NFC championships and the Super Bowl. No, they haven't won one yet. But damn, this is the kind of stuff that makes you think maybe if Adam Peters were still here, this wouldn't happen. But he's in Washington and I bet he's giggling. I bet a lot of people are, that don't like the Niners are like giggling right now. But you know what? It's just a backup tight end and it doesn't really matter because the guy doesn't play. How many catches did Charlie Warner make last year? Three. So we're looking to replace three catches on the Niners' offense. Who could it be? Logan Thomas still available, isn't he? Niners need a tight end, huh? 